Welcome back to the channel guys. Last night one of the local model club pilots uh, ran into him at dinner and he mentioned that someone had lost a plane out off the field last week and hadn't been able to find it. Thought well what a great opportunity to take the Phantom 3 out and see if we can locate it. This is my Phantom 3. I purchased this a few months back. I've been having a blast with it doing aerial videography. You've seen this in some of the videos on the channel, uh, RC boat review and some aerial shots and cinematic shots. It works amazing. Recently you might have seen in the news that more and more rescue operations are using UAVs, drones, quadcopters, whatever you want to call them, and having some great success. So I thought, well, what a great opportunity, let's give it a go. The local model field is a grass strip bordered on one side by a pretty severe water hazard, and the rest of it is bordered on some pretty thick brush, about seven feet deep most of it, and then trees beyond that. If you go down in that, it's really, really difficult. You only have a few feet that you can see in any direction when you're walking in it. But from an aerial view, we have a whole different perspective. Once I got to the field, the pilot told me approximately what direction he had been. He had a really good line on it when it went down, but we don't know how far to the bush line it would end up. So I took the Phantom off and just tracked that direction and really quickly ran across the target. I was able to find the plane in under four minutes once we had become airborne. Just moving slowly over the field at a reasonable altitude where I can still catch detail on my FPV monitor, which is my phone, I was able to pick it out, hovered over it, he was able to pick it up and carry it back. 100% success, I was really happy. I spent the rest of the day just cruising around, taking some video of the other aircraft flying that day and had a blast. If you're going to use your Phantom for search and rescue, a couple of tips. Get yourself some extra batteries because it would really suck if you hadn't found anything or wanted to do more of a search and you were out of battery. I run with three and carry them inside my case. Also, get yourself or make yourself a hood for your monitor, whatever downlink you're using. The Phantom 3 has room for, you can get make a tablet fit in here. Just make a, a sunshade. It's, it's critical on sunny days like when we were out there, you can't see anything without a sunshade. So either this or maybe set it up to use some goggles. Get yourself a neck strap as well. Uh, if you're flying for a long time, three batteries, you'll be airborne for more than an hour. You need a neck strap on your transmitter, otherwise it gets kind of uncomfortable. Also take with you a laptop, power supply, and an inverter, as well as an SD card adapter. These will become critical if you don't spot the, the target from your FPV, from your downlink, which is pretty low res. You can review the footage on the spot and pixel creep and go looking for something more interesting. Do this before you run out all your batteries. So then if you find something on your downlink, on your laptop, you can go have a look for it. Overall, I simply love this Phantom 3. I've had great times with it in the videos. There'll be plenty more on the channel upcoming. Uh, I'll be using this for you name it. it. It just flies amazing. With the price drop since the Pan Phantom 4 came out, the Phantom 3 standard is incredible value for the buck. This thing just works amazing. For the price, I couldn't do the camera and the gimbal and put it on a, a platform of my own because the camera and gimbal would cost more than this entire ready to fly system. With exception, the batteries are a little pricey. Good luck in all your RC drone UAV FPV adventures. Hopefully you get to take part in a search and rescue, whatever it may be. Hopefully it's uh, not too many people get lost out there, but if someone does, I'm a lot happier knowing that other people around have these and can come looking for me. Check out the other videos on this channel on the uh, RC playlist and I'll catch you guys next week. Cheers.